what is going on everybody it's epic here and in today's video we're going over the low recall chimera class setup here in mw3 personally i think this gun's it's not too bad but it's also not the best so it's just kind of mid it does have low recoil at longer ranges like across the map it does tend to get a little bit bouncy so it's not gonna have like zero recoil at that range but mid range to close range it's gonna have zero recoil let's get right into the attachments all right for the first attachment for the muzzle i have the stir 45 sky fury compensator l for the recoil control for the barrel i have the 10 sa phoenix for the bullet velocity and range since this gun doesn't have too much range to it the gun kit control hip fire accuracy as well as recoil control which is going to help out at longer ranges for the stock i use the ravage 10 so i could get crouch movement speed sprint speed as well as ads speed for the magazine, I had the 45 round mag. I mainly chose this just because there is a health difference from MW2 to MW3. In MW2, the TTK was very, very fast just because the health was lower. In this game, the health is 150. So I definitely recommend using those 45 rounds. Those 15 extra shots are definitely going to help. And then finally, for the rear grip, I have the D37 grip for the gun kit control as well as recoil control. For the secondary, I had my Renetti SMG setup. For the tactical, I had stim shot, lethal semtex, field upgrade, munitions box. For the gloves, I had scavenger, boots, I had tactical. And then for the gear, I had EOD padding. For the vest, I had the demolitions vest because that is resupply. You're going to be able to get your Semtexes back as well as your stim shots. And here is the full class setup yet again on the screen. If you guys are new, make sure you guys like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Alright, today we are using the Chimera. And I just had this game last game. Or, or this map last game i try to get a gameplay with this but it wasn't working out too well so i'm gonna try this game and if it doesn't work then it's probably just this map i'm not really good with this gun on this map probably got you got you got you come back here And then we got him. Loki's streaking right now. Two off of the heli. Stupidest peek I did, but... I didn't bro these kids are playing like weirdos why are they laying on the ground is my first question that's actually annoying of course we run into the bass B I don't know where I was getting shot by or who I was getting shot by Here we go, starting to do a little bit of damage now. Got you. Oh, 
I don't know why my oh it's because the guy was right underneath me my helicopter started bugging and shooting me honestly one of the most irritating things that can happen in this game I don't know what these two guys are doing Thirteen. Oh heck no, we gotta get our butt inside. Fifteen. Call both these things in. Go back here. Throwing Semtex. Got a kill with the nade, surprisingly. can do is I can flank him get him I'm gonna climb up here so I can get the height advantage I got no clue where they're shooting at or where they are, I mean. Twenty nine. Thirty. Holy smokes. Finally got the freaking nuke with the Chimera. Now I do gotta get I do gotta get another gameplay with the um Tac fifty six since one of you guys wanted that. I got M16 with the nuke. I think Tag 56 is gonna be a little bit of a challenge though. Since it really isn't like super good, it's kinda like mid in this game. You helicopter up. Of course, I die.
How in the world? I didn't even know you could get in the water right there. I don't know if that was just me that knew that or that didn't know that, but. Oh, I gotta call in the nuke. Dang, wasn't fast enough to call in the nuke, but we got the MGV with the Chimera. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.